Hi all, today um, I'd want to go over a fairly common Verilog or system Verilog interview question. Um, this is uh, related to the difference between a task and a function. Um, alternatively, you could be asked to describe what is a task or a function. The following presentation should be able to answer uh, this question. So in general, a function or a task encapsulates a group of statements that perform a specific task. Uh, let's go over um, the features of a function. No timing delays. What that means is you cannot have any wait statements, pound delays, event controls, or any notion of time in a function. In short, a function cannot consume time to execute. Only called other functions. This limits uh, what can be called within a function, which is just another function. And a function cannot call a task because a task can potentially have delays or it can consume time. A function should at least have one input argument and cannot have in out or um, output arguments. A function typically only returns one value unless um, it is a type void. Uh, then of course, no return value is required. Uh, whereas it can have many reference arguments or inputs. Functions are uh, synthesizable, again, as they do not consume time. Um, these are common in both designs and the test bridge. A function can be, uh, can be used in operand. What, what does that mean? A function with a non-void return type can be used as an operand, so we can easily use the output of a function in an expression. So, you know, let's say you have an output of another function and you want to add it to 5. You can easily do that. Uh, just have uh, that function with whatever the um, arguments are, and the result will become the operand of the expression. Okay. On the other end, task. Um, unlike um, a function, a task can choose to consume time. Um, a function can have pound. Um, a function, for instance, cannot have pound delays. Uh, however, a task can. A task can have pound delays, wait statements, fork joins, and uh, fork join any um, for parallel operations. A task can easily call any function uh, or task as it does not have any limitation uh, in terms of time consumption. Uh, there's also no restriction in the number of arguments you could have. Zero to many arguments in a task. Also, there's no restriction on the type of arguments. Uh, which means we can have inputs, uh, in-outs, or output arguments to a task. A task uh, does not um, return an output like a function, uh, but you could achieve a similar functionality or a similar kind of functionality can be achieved in a task uh, with an argument, uh, with an output argument, essentially. Um, because there's a notion of time consumption in a task, a task inherently is not synthesizable and are almost exclusively found only in the test benches. Also, um, we cannot use a task as an operand for a function or in a function uh, because it does not explicitly return a value. All right, guys, that's the difference between a function and a task. 
I'll see you in the next video. Take care.